Hey, what's going on guys and girls? Old Colleague Phoenix here and welcome to episode number 34 of my 7 Days to Die Let's Play series for Alpha 16. So I did a little bit of work on this. Um, I tried to make it look nice and uniform. I fixed the posts that were not even with each other. Um, so everything should be somewhat symmetrical except for this middle bit, which if I wanted to make it symmetrical... I'd have to make it double wide. I'd have to upgrade it. Give it the same look. So that looks nice and neat now, I think. And then we can add the piece. Holy shit. The piece on the back of this. And if you wanted to make it the same. You would click in advanced mode. Whoops, went past it. Put these here, like this. Just to make it look a little bit fancy. Give it a bit of style. That's not just a massive square. And then it kind of makes it look like that's supporting this bit as well. So it kind of works out all right. I probably just fit through these gaps, can't I? Anything is with that there, can I walk past? I can, that's fine then. We'll just make it look all beautifully uniform. Tent with it. Ah, oh, damn it, of course then I find it and I skip past it twice. Holy shit. That was an endeavor. Uh, is that all of them? Except for the two middle pieces, so I need one more. That goes like that. And that one... Goes like that. Hopefully I didn't overdo it, but I think that looks somewhat nice. For a little gardening area. It's not perfect by any stretch of the imagination, but it's... I think it's alright. Ah, oh, shit. Fuck. It's alright, I'll fix it later. Is that going to trigger everybody's OCD? I'm sorry. Alright. So we need food. That's that's an essential item right now. I am hungry as fuck. Spent like a couple in-game hours getting that all sorted out and making it look nice, so... That wasted some time. Holy crap, am I going to have to eat all this meat just to get full? May get lucky and get a couple wellness ups here. Awesome. Back to back to square Uno. Now with my health, so that's good. At least I've got the same amount as what I started the game with now. Alright, so let's put these buckets in here, I guess. We got a couple buckets with water in it, which is nice. Always a good thing. I gotta sort through this later. I just don't want to spend too much time doing it right now. Okay. Let's jump down here. Oh, don't die. Okay. This looks somewhat at least nice now. It's like a little quaint area. Nice little quaint area. Oh, I replanted some trees over there as well. Am I cold? I'm wearing a fucking puffer coat that's got like 22 insulation. Are you kidding me? Uh, so where do we want to head? Actually, what do we want to do? Hmm. Let's see. We could go drop that stuff off to the trader that we hadn't done yet. There's still a lot of city in the burnt area, it looks like, to explore. Maybe we could go check out what this airdrop is. What, what level am I? I'm nearly level 68, which is what I need to get the chemistry station so i'm gonna definitely do that today i'm getting that done today we're getting a chemistry station built before the day before the episode is out which means we need anytime we see a zombie we need to fuck them up by shooting them in the brain is the preferred method hurrah and any bird's nest we see, we also need the feathers from because 
We have got no feathers at all, and we need steel arrows. We've only got 24 left, so... Any bird's nests are worth picking up right now. No ignoring any of them. I see one I should... Take advantage of its feathery goodness. It's going to be hard to spot while driving on the mini bike because the frame rate dips so hard. But that's okay. Alright, here we go. Three numero uno. You fucking cock. Why did you turn around? Can you explain that to me? Oh shit, missed. Is hip firing just as accurate? Nope. Oh my god, he just moves his head in all the right ways. You just do this to me, sir. <laughs> There's our level up. Holy fuck. Oh, let's just get his skills. Yes, I got enough. Let's buy the chemistry station. All right. I ended up not having enough skill points because I ended up getting um, science level 7 because I needed it to unlock the chemistry station in the first place, so... We did that. Hopefully by using the chemistry station, though, we'll level up our science anyway somewhat. I know I'm missing a lot of bird's nests, but we want to get this airdrop quickly, because now we can go make the chemistry station. We've got to think about getting all the materials together for that to build it, and then placing it and using it. Maybe make some fertilizer and stuff for the plants. Could be an option. I definitely want to make some first aid kits. We've got a couple at least. We've now owned a couple first aid kits. Wait a minute, have we explored this area? Not really. Have a quick swift. Just for a second. Just to see what's off in the distance. Looks like desert and a factory. Um, yeah, it's definitely desert out there. Okay, cool. Well, we know what's that way now. Man, seven days, like, it's been a lot more enjoyable now that they've dropped the wood um, cost because there's no way I probably would have bothered building that little garden area if they hadn't. And now that they have, it only being, like, two wood for a wood frame and, like, four to upgrade it to the first set of wood is so much better, especially early game. That's going to be a hundred times better. Right, we should be able to actually make, like, a hundred steel arrows or something now. How much? How much? this do we actually get? 79, that's okay. No, I just skipped a bird bird's nest. But I want to kill this guy. Rip, got an engine. What? Excuse me, sir. Must have fucking really strained his back to carry around an entire engine. <laughs> just seems absurd. Why would you do that to yourself, really? Alright, so... What do we need for this chem? Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Got it. Alright, we should have everything we need, honestly, to do this. Let's need some wood quickly as well. Now, also, if you hit down a tree, and hopefully this will work, and you sprint at it on the last hit, it, like, launches forward. It propels forward. I normally try to do it without accidentally bumping into the tree. But yeah, I was trying it yesterday, especially on the smaller, like the, the, the 600 health trees. They seem to fucking fly. Alright, let's get up this hill with this mini bike. Come on. There we go. We're going to just leave that lumberjack. We're not going to worry about every single one we come across, seeing as we got the level up now. Lovely, there's plants floating. Ah, never change seven days to die, never change. Fucking always random shit floating houses that are incorrectly built. Game's fun sometimes. Alright, let's get in. Get in and up. To the top. Beautiful. I kind of like the look of that. I don't know, maybe that's... that's Maybe that's just because I built it, but I kind of like it, so... Let me know what you guys and girls think of it. Whether it's actually got a use or not. Alright, let's put those in there. Alright, med med medical. Okay, so... I will need... 
Let's see. Short iron pipe for one. That. I will need... Fuck, I forget. Uh, beaker, burning barrel. So we need two of those. A burning barrel. Yep. Got that. We need three cooking pots. Which I've got. And that's it, I think. That's it, boy. Let's build this shit. Woo! Chemistry station. Orsium. This can fuck off. <laughs> they can these. Like, this is really restricted area. Oh, shit. You didn't spawn anything behind me because of that lag. No? Alright, beautiful. It's just to open this up a little bit. It's a little bit cramped in here, I feel. I don't think we really need these protecting us from our own room. Or we might, because you never know. Let's just fix that. There we go. Looks nice now. Alright, the chemistry station should be done. Okay, so let's just put our narcotics lab right next to our sleeping bag so we can always get high. Alright, sorry about the quick cut. Anyway, now first aid kits. Blood bag, grain alcohol, bandage, and duct tape. Now, do I have duct tape in here? I should. I actually don't have as much as I normally do, which is surprising. Blood bag, regular bandages, grain alcohol. Nice. Just get some wood for it. Turn that shit on. Alright, now we can make four. Nice. Doesn't take long at all. Stuff. Sweet. Alright, we got that. So we've got six first aids. I mean, that's pretty good. Honestly. And we've, we've got blood draw kits that we could use as well if we wanted to make more. Let's see here. I've got nitrate powder. What else did I need for fertilizer? Turds and dirt. Turds are in there. And dirt is definitely in there, but we'll just use the smaller stack for now so we don't use it all. 41. Fuck that. Uh, five? It's half an hour. Six? That's fucking mental, dude. Six. Okay. It's gonna take half an hour. That's gonna be like two episodes worth of that fucking fertilizer cooking up. That's crazy. Alright, so let's do that. Let's do this, 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 this. That. Put the flashlights with the guns, seeing as they attach to them. Put the rotting flesh and the eggs over here, and the engine can go... I don't know, I guess it could go in here, along with the wood. No, it can't, because it won't fit. Now it will. Alright. And the schematic... Oh, well, I guess I'll put the engine in with that. So I'll put the engine in with the other engine. We got a couple decent engines in here too. All right, it may be time to start thinking about maybe electricity to see how that all works. I think that could be pretty cool. But what's a wiring tool cost? Wire tool, nine forged steel and three medic mechanical parts. That's easy enough to do. If I could buy my steel. All right, suppose we have to make that in here. Wire tool. I swear I had one in a chest, and it's, I think, the one that got corrupted. Almost positive of it. We got so much plant fiber, we'd never need any ever. Like, ever in our lives would we ever need any. This game's nice sometimes. I like when it's not snowing in this biome. It's it's nice. Right, how's the little plants going? They're going all right. They look like they're, they're, they're doing something. Which is nice. It's what we want them doing. Doing something. Alright, that's going to take 5,000 years. This is 32 seconds away from being done. We're going to end up needing our battery bank, which... Did I leave over at the prison? I think I did. Okay. Okay, so yeah, I left that over at the prison. That's, that's just fantastic. I wish this was one shot as well. Like, I wish you could one shot these. The nearly 300 level steel axe. 
I don't think that'd be unreasonable to, to want. So what are you on for? Nothing. You're on for absolutely no reason at all. Beautiful. We got a level 300 wiring tool. There you go. Well, anyway, guys and girls, it looks like a pair of pliers my dad has. I think next time I go down to my parents' house, I'm actually going to take a photo of these because it looks exactly the same. 100%. Even the color of the handle is the same. But anyway, guys and girls, that is going to be the end of this episode. If you liked it, remember to leave a like. If you want to see more 7 Days to Die in the future, be sure to hit that subscribe button. Follow me on all my social media links down in the description below. Thank you all so much for watching, and I hope you all have a lovely day. All right, peace.